My whole life, I've always been asked the same question. What do you want to be when you grow up? I've had so many answers to this question, but none of them ever seemed good enough for those around me. I spent my life working towards a set of goals that were determined for me before I even entered this world. Studying for every test, putting in the extra practice hours in sports, pushing myself constantly. But for what? Success. I've grown up learning and relearning that quality of life is measured in success. That life is measured in every goal you make, the Ivy League education you get, and ultimately, the job you have. And then I went to Australia, and I spent five months on learning everything I thought I knew about the word success. While it's true that Australian culture is not so different from that of America, there is one extreme difference in mindset. For Australians, success is not determined by your paycheck or your education. Only one thing down under truly determines the quality of life. Happiness. I learned this slowly after watching the smiles people modeled day after day, seeing people surf daily without a care in the world, and watching students show up to class eager to learn, not because they had to, but because they wanted to. The moment this really hit me was when I visited my Australian friend's house. He told his parents all about his future plans, and for once, I watched him answer the age-old questions with no repercussions. He was met with support and enthusiasm, encouraged to do what would bring him the most happiness. That single conversation impacted me in a way I never imagined, and I suddenly was looking through a new lens. I went to Australia and spent five months truly living, only doing things that brought me joy. I found myself bungee jumping and scuba diving and surfing. I traveled and met amazing people, and I didn't do it for the success it would bring me or for the approval of those around me. For five months, I was completely and truly happy, and I wasn't expected to be anything else. That was enough. 